Hello everyone and welcome again in a new video tutorial. Today guys I'm going to show you how you can install the virtual box into your Windows computer. This applies to Windows 8, Windows 8.1, Windows 7 and Windows 10. So first of all you have to open your browser and you have to go to for example Google, you have to go to the search tab and you type virtual box. This will open few results for you and I would suggest to you to open any of it. You can open Oracle VM virtual box or downloads Oracle virtual box, virtual machine virtual box is the same. So I open it already in a new window and from here guys I would suggest to you to down to click on the one which is matching to your computer. If you are using a Linux distribution in that case you will have to click on the Linux distributions. If you are using OS X hosts you have to click here otherwise if you have a Windows computer just click on Windows host this will download automatically a file into your computer so in Google Chrome you can just click on it and click show in show in folder and this will take you to the folder where the where the file was downloaded for me I have it now on the desktop and I will install it so first of all you will have to click on it two times and then it will start running it might ask you to allow it to run and then you will have just to click OK if you are using Windows to have it running. So here the Windows installer just started and we'll just click Next. Here we will have to choose the location and the, the package which you will install. I decided to install everything so I will just click Next and here you can either choose to create start menu and entries, create a shortcut in the desktop, create a shortcut in the quick launch bar, I don't need it and register file associations I will just leave it like this and then I will just click next you can leave all of them tick this not a problem and then it is asking here if we want to proceed with installation now we'll just click yes here we'll have to click install as it is asking for allowing that and we'll just wait as it says here this may, might take a few minutes based on how fast is your computer or how big is your RAM but it shouldn't take more than 10 minutes as a maximum so here it is asking us if we want to install a universal serial bus for Oracle so we'll just click install and we'll just continue with the installation as you can see guys the installation have already finished so you can either take this or untick it and you just click finish so this is my execution software I'll just put it here and here we have the new oracle box ready to go i we'll have just to click on it and then it will be working we'll have to wait a few minutes or maybe just a few seconds as you can see the, the virtual box is like this and then you can just start working on based on which software you want to use and how you want to name it i hope this video tutorial was useful to you guys if you still need help or assistance you can always contact us if you like this video please feel free to click like share and don't forget to subscribe and thanks for watching and talk to you soon in a new video tutorial